Now, 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 one now impress. impress. All right, let's, All right, start, let's the start the show properly. Show properly. <laughs> Don Israel, no they shake hand. You don't pay. CMD. I would say this money when they throw nine be the table money. Or guys sit down where they made it. say you who? Oh 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 oh! Music everywhere. Ah uh ah -uh. ah! Uh, my glitter. They did Chris. <laughs> uh, you guys came at the right time. Anyway, I'm doing my photo shoot. You know my show is coming up. So. Uh, not just my show, my show and my bed is coming up. So I'm doing a photo shoot today. So I think you guys came at the right time. Uh, you welcome to my house. You welcome to my house. Let's go. As you can see, uh, my show. Yeah. June 23rd, a co hotel. Mm -hmm. This is my small company. This is where I'm managing now. See, God bring better money. Yeah. Uh, as you can see, it's about knowing face now. Uh, this one, an actress. Uh, now this one, I they sponsor the one where they sponsor me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is Mazi, Mazi okay, okay. Uh, Now my UK burger, me and I the travel next week. Uh, we are going to London. Uh, all this one are my bikes. Uh, you know, so because of food these days now. Uh, 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 now they wash my bike. <laughs> uh, because of food these days now, so we need to buy the one so that any day food no day. Now electric, all of them are electric. Uh, all of them are electric. I know Mr. Shin is electrical. Uh, <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, hey, hey. All right, like I said, uh, I'm doing my photo shoot. So you came at the right time. Let me introduce the house to your house. Yeah, this is a, you know, it's a foodie. Yeah, that DJ Kesley, international DJ Kesley, world famous, fastest finger as Royal like him. Good. <laughs> uh, hey. This is Chaka Chaka. Uh, this is a new boy you guys should watch out for on the, in, in the comedy industry. Uh, this guy. He shot it. Uh, is a Oludia of Lagos. Eh? Oludia of Lagos. Yeah, depends when they have a botanical name. Oluwa Bolade shot it. Now there are two they shot together. Uh, if this one shoot, if he fine, I didn't know from his face. If this one shoot, if he no fine, I didn't know from his face. Uh, so, uh, oh God. You see, you, see, you, see, you see the way he dress, you don't need to know he work. That is Zora lifestyle. Any suit when I wear, now it's swan. Any suit when I wear, when fine. Any day I wear suit, when not fine. Baba not being swan. Uh, <laughs> because anything when this guy is so, now in the rip. That's the first female member of us of the stalker. That one never make an she they borrow me money. Uh, but now I mean they sponsor her. Uh, so, uh, this is... Uh, I don't know what he, because you get many words. He's a man of conglomerate. Mm. Uh, and I did handle my, uh, all my, most of my internet doings. Uh, in case you won't book me from abroad. Now they handle all those ones. Uh, hey, Roya. This is Roya, MC Roya. You see Roya and Chaka Chaka. Uh, now there are two, one collect my legacy uh, for the comedy industry. And trust me, they nearly, they kill it back to back. All right, this is Tega. Uh, Tega is the second girl in the house of the stalker. Yes, is that she's an actress. She the art. No, no worry. If not acting, she's a big art. Uh, with all the premium go bring money, my sponsor her. Uh, so, I be now. Uh, now because say uh, your taste high. Normally, uh, if not blue for don't shoot scenes. Uh, so concept. Uh, this guy. In case you they talk to me, I tell you twenty million as a comedian to perform. Now I'll show you the follow talk. I don't get big eye like that. Hey, I know they charge past 10 million. Yeah, hey, in case you hear 10 million, you hear now me to talk to you. If you hear 20 million, now you don't. So when you hear 20 million, I say, give the photo to the soccer. <laughs> <laughs> so you remember another one, Kevin Gates. Hey, uh, Kevin Gates. Uh, normally, he likes your time. Maybe I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where he does it now. No, uh, oh, no, 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 I'm, no, 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 I'm Kevin Gay normally. So you're welcome. This is uh, where uh, I stay. This is where I stay. Uh, uh, when are they say best comedian back to back five years in a row? You know, as I, you know, say Nigerians, you know, live evidence, see evidence, show. Uh, 
So I they look for us now when I go pull, I go pull award. <laughs> you can see all the awards, man on check, who really to the world. They will recognize me for my time. They stock all of them there, all the awards them there. You understand? So uh, music everywhere uh, is a is a is a privilege or is a big honor to have you guys in my place. Yeah, when you hear House of the Soccer, this is the house. This is the full house of the soccer. We don't pass like this. You understand? Uh, next thing, uh, the, this is Kevin Great. Uh, this is Kevin Great. Uh, we started together, yes, from Ikotun. Uh, that time, man, I don't know left and right, but we don't say they go somewhere. They go left. Yeah, he they go left, he they go right. So, but thank God, uh, me and I, we just say we did wrong road till we bust out for right road. Yeah, thank God, say we don't do right road now. Uh, so, uh, those of you who don't really know all the house of the soccer, June 23rd, the co hotel, keep it locked down. Yes, I funny. I funny. Music everywhere, you're welcome to my place. Um, I, I consider this a privilege because I'm not a musician, so I think this show is for musical art, but because the way I infuse music inside my comedy, that is why when I don't put me for music, thank God. Even me, I don't be musician, I don't sing. Oh, I never see the one where they feature me. Don't, don't, don't. But I play the song now, and I did, hey, God. Ah, can say, you don't know your work again. Oh. I'll play the song for Nana. I'm gonna don't say dada, yes. Don't dada. Let's go. I no can play. Oh, okay, I can play. Okay, I can play. Okay, I can play. That's one. Normally, I funny that. Uh, hey, all right. Uh, that's the one uh, Goya Men official me. Yeah, but watch out for my EP. <laughs> <laughs> It's all your dear. And I'm going to tell you guys, what is it? Music everywhere, you hear song. All right, it's still music everywhere, man. Yeah, music everywhere. But the truth is that music is life, oh. Yeah, music is life. Anywhere you day, if you hear music, whether you they hear the song, you know they hear the song. That's why they hear beat, it gives you life. You get it. All right, like I said, my name is Des Tucker. Uh, they call me the Comedy Catalyst. Why? Because I brought change to the game. I say it everywhere and uh, with my full chest. Okay, first of all, I want to appreciate the privilege to give me your platform, music everywhere. All right? I, I think I deserve it. I deserve it because I think uh, uh, whatever people are doing, when you do it differently, you stand out and you be recognized. I think that will happen to me. And I think uh, inside the comedy industry, when I came in with music, I came in with music. No, they have music comedian, but mine is different. You understand? I came in with a touch of Kisley, and that was different. And that was that was the big difference that shaked the industry and reshuffled the card. You understand? The only best comedian not be beans. Uh, I'm not being proud, but you know easy. I don't want a show that people just come and they laugh and they go back to their problems. I want a situation whereby you come, you listen, you learn. You unlearn, you relearn things that you have learned before. So we need to confess positivity. It's not hard. It's just that it's a little bit challenging. So we, I don't want to do my ticket for five thousand naira because people, people find it difficult to even eat. So us to use five thousand buy regular ticket. So normally I would don't have a free, but you know my manager she, you know they really like free things. I make up with my manager. You understand? So do I the manager? <laughs> So that is why I want to do 3,000 for our regular ticket. VIP is 10,000 naira. We have table for 1.5 million. We have table for 5 million naira. So if you know if you buy 5 million, you buy 1.5. You know, let me say anyone, you know if you afford. So VIP is 10,000 naira. Regular is 3,000 naira. Anybody when buy with this ship, they follow instruction. All right, see music everywhere, man. Listen to me. Uh, if you are logged on to this program, it shows that, yes, you know what they really the pop. It shows that you are active, you know, understand. Uh, the time formation, everything. Now, yeah, that's why you watch me like this now. Nah. You did the right sound there. You know, understand. You don't say get the way you go enter wrong road, you go bust up for the right road. Uh, not to say that mistake, you enter this music everywhere. God want me to watch this program so that your life will change. You know, understand. They went by with this ship, they follow instruction. I think the involvement is personal. Yeah. Uh, there's no, there's no general development. Trust me. So everybody's developing himself or herself in the industry, in the in the comedy space. 
So I think uh, it, there will be speed if there is body that is responsible for the development. Okay, let's come together as a union and foster growth or to, to, to push the growth of the industry. I think we would have gone far than this. But since everybody is doing it personally, I know good owned by many people will not live long because everybody thinks everybody is feeding it. First of all, how do I get my fans outside this country? The fact that I have fans over there, it means that they understand the content here. Okay? So, but when we travel, when we travel there, we just do more of English comedy, not like Nigerian where you just sleep pigeon, pigeon, pigeon. You understand? Though this, the outside there, we have 70% of Nigerian crowd there. So the few foreign people that will be in the crowd, maybe a Nigerian man coming to the show, got married to a British, or got married to another country. So he's coming with his wife. Maybe a Nigerian woman that's coming for the show, got married to a British. So those are the few white we have. So we are not going there to do show for just white people. So it's still the Nigerian community that are there that are married to other people and other nationalities. Those are the people that we have on the show. I don't really have a process. I don't really have a, I don't, I don't really create a process. Even sometimes I, I marvel about my, my ability to talk without thinking, without practicing, without realizing. Do you get? So, like now, I'm going to London. As I'm talking to you now, I don't have a specific comedy, okay? Like other comedians, they will write uh, number one to number 30 of the jokes they will talk in a city. So, they will say, okay, I will do five in this city, I will do six in this city, I will do five in this city. As I'm talking to you now, my head is blank. But just give me the mic. That is why I say I'm a born comedian, it's inborn. And when you, are, when you have it inborn, when you just hold the mic, things flow. And my ability, to, to, to translate reality with this little sense of humor, that makes my jokes reality. Okay, I want to be creative. I want to do something different. You understand? Uh, me and my DJ, we just click. We just click, you understand? Uh, it'd be like, who in leg now 42 and you buy shoe 42. You know how to put your leg, you go enter. So me and my DJ, DJ Kesley, we met, and we met at Boca Hot, which we are still going this evening, every Thursday. So. We, we met and now the style I brought into the comedy industry was my normal comedy club setting. Now, why is it normal comedy club setting? Because people come to club to drink, comedy club. People come to the club to drink. To, now, when they are listening to comedy and you, we put little, you infuse music, it don't look distracting to them because they, they actually came to enjoy themselves. So when you are talking, talking, no matter how funny you are, when you keep talking, 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 it be like how they eat shingon. Get where you go shop and eat the shingon, no, call sweet again. That's what it just be. So by infusing music, that is how me and Kiss, they just started doing it. I, we don't know. We did not sit down one day and plan, okay, let's be doing it like this. I'll talk some more. You go play some more. Wish some, uh, many other comedians believe that we rehearse. And some even call you now to do rehearsals. Yeah, but now they enjoy them because they just put out for hotel, three days, guy with all fresh. Uh, and he, 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 when he tells you that we don't realize, they don't believe him. They think that he's hiding, he's hiding some secret. So they want to realize with him. And the funniest thing is that what they realize, they don't really do it on the stage. Which proves to them that, okay, true, true, this is not realize. Okay. So the way I say I'm born comedian, that's why Kesley is born a DJ. And I graduate to some people who say DJ and I went to go to school. Like, wait till you realize, they always <laughs> I could not say, yeah, I wish I didn't spend too much money, but we keep, we keep going to end up to be DJ. <laughs> All right, but the truth is, uh, my DJ is, is uh, I'll, I'll, bring him up, I'll bring him up shortly. But the truth is, in, in this industry, if you keep doing the same thing and you expect different results, it's called insanity. All right? So you need to do it differently for you to stand out. You understand? Uh, when everybody is doing the same thing and you join them and you do the same thing, you think that you are not progressing, but immediately you twist it a little. When people say, okay, this is not regular, this is not a regular one, 
before you know, you are at the top of the game. So that is how I saw it. So when I carry that comedy industry, that, that comedy club, because truly I was the I was a king in the comedy club industry. So when I came into the mainstream, I was not, it's not like, like I was prepared. It's like when you read, you read well before you enter exam hall, trust me. When it is, they come like that, you just they know, say, okay, I don't read this one, I don't read this one. So I came prepared because of the comedy club. You know what it takes to talk to people that are drunk and they are laughing? The same thing you are telling someone that is drunk or tipsy and he laughs. Imagine someone that is normal and the person is hearing it. Ah, you know, say so the person, he must, he must fall for ground. Mm -hmm.